Distinguished speakers, ladies and gentlemen, dear compatriots, in the free Iran, after the Mullahs, the National Council of Resistance of Iran is committed to holding free elections and uh, respecting the rights of all people. I call on the international community and world leaders to adopt their policy on Iran in line with the Iranian people's desire and to identify Iran with its people and not with its criminal rulers. Thank you all very much. Abraham Raisi must be removed from office by the people of Iran, and he must be prosecuted for crimes against humanity and genocide. And today, by all indications, the resistance movement in Iran has never been stronger. Resistance units in Iran are the center of hope for the Iranian people. They're the engine of change from within during the uprisings and continued protests. But there is an alternative. Well-organized, fully prepared, perfectly qualified and popularly supported alternative called the M.E.K. The MEK is committed to democracy, human rights, and freedom for every citizen of Iran. And it's led by an extraordinary woman. Mrs. Rajavi is an inspiration to the world. Her 10-point plan for the future of Iran will ensure freedom of expression, freedom of assembly, and the freedom for every Iranian to choose their elected leaders. Our greatest hope must always be for a peaceful, cooperative, and harmonious coexistence with Iran and all the sovereign nations of the region and the world. The United States will always be ready to embrace peace with all who seek it. The American people are strong, and the American people stand for freedom. <laughs>